In this lesson, we will learn how to create an Angular 2 app using Plunker. First, simply go to plunker.co and then sign up for your account. Once you have your account, simply log in and then go to launch the editor. A new editor will be shown. In this screen, you will see the different files and then an editor and also different packages that you can choose from. For today, what you want is an Angular 2 template. To do that, simply go to the menu and click the drop down list box of a new button. Navigate to Angular. As you can see, we have different templates for Angular. We have Angular 1, Angular 1.1, and up to Angular 1.5. In here, you will see three types of templates for Angular 2. We have ECMAScript 6, ECMAScript 5, and TypeScript. In here, let's choose TypeScript. One good thing about Plunker is that once you've set up your template, it's now ready to be run. Before that, let's check the files of our Angular 2 app. On the left side, you will see config.js, index.html, the common readme, and the TypeScript files. You have app.ts and main.ts. And finally, you have the styles.css. Let's first check the app.ts. This TypeScript is actually the root app component of our application. And as you can see, there's a template with an HTML code on it. And another class with a constructor and a property. In here, we can simply type our name. And once it's done, simply hit run. And that's it. That's your first ever Angular 2 app. Now that you have an Angular 2 app that is actually running, you can now check the different files and even share it on the web. Just head back to the file section and check the config.js, the app.ts, and main.ts. Or you can just play around on a template. You can type hello and your name, and then simply put your surname. And as you can see here, our plunker is automatically reflected and refreshed. If you want to share your work, simply head down this description, my Angular 2 app, and then click save. And that's it. You can share this plunker by simply copying paste this URL and send it to your friends. Alternatively, you can download the copy and send it via email. On our next lesson, we will learn how to run 
the simple Angular 2 app on your local machine. And that's about it for this lesson.